So I, uh, we're here for the big protest. I see you guys are uh, representing the other side. You think we ought to be staying home? I think You don't think we're ready to open? Why is that? There are so many people in the hospital right now really, really sick. Okay. Every, I'm a pediatric and ER nurse for the last 17 years. Okay. My hospital is full. Other smaller hospitals are getting full. And it's, there, no one is ready yet. Every night I take care of patients that cannot breathe, that are dying. My nurses are dying. My staff is dying. We are not ready yet. Okay. Now, there's some nurses that are here that are talking about being furloughed that are like for the elective surgeries and things. What do you think about them shutting down elective surgeries and some of the other healthcare needs? Right now, it's overflowing. Right now, we're not ready yet to go there yet. So what hospital are you in? You here in Chicago? Yes, I'm in Chicago. Okay. I see you have the uh, Pride fan there. So what does uh, Pride have to do with this situation? I'm an out gay, proud gay nurse. Okay. And I will always be out and proud. In the middle of all of this, I show my pride. Okay. So are you here more for the pride thing or more for the health? For the health. Okay. So what do you think about like the health disparities in the LGBT community and all the problems they're having? It's worse now. There's, it's worse now? Yes. Isn't it always bad there, though? I, from what I understand, that they're at far greater risk of a lot of different diseases and everything. Do you think it's the government's responsibility to take care of them? As in? What's that? As in what, what do you mean of more diseases? Just as far as, like, STDs, AIDS, HIV, things like that. And so is everything else. It's the same, what's that? And everything else. Everyone is, has nothing to do with that right now. It has nothing to do with the lifestyle or anything like that? No. Well, what do you think, why do you think the percentages are so much higher there? Because the disparities of access to healthcare. Because the disparities of access to healthcare.